upset over cheese? Parmesan cheese created Parmesan. It's not an alter. It's an ingredient in a dinner I was supposed to make. <laughs> How was I supposed to know that? Someone has to tell you not to spoon feed yourself an entire jar of Parmesan cheese? The dinner! Jesus! <laughs> I'm never gonna eat cheese again. In fact, I might cut a theory altogether. It's not about the cheese. It's about us. <laughs> nope, I'm not doing it. You're being emotional and now you're trying to turn this into a whole other thing. All I'm trying to do is have an honest conversation with you. God forbid it's ever a good time to talk about anything. We're talking right now, aren't we? Just, I had a great day at work. I went into the car to go home. Something compelled me to watch the cat camera. I wasn't expecting to see you, let alone watch you eat that cheese. I wasn't expecting how it made me feel. As I watched you, I cried. Like, really cried. It's like your body's telling you something and you just feel the need to catch up. This isn't you being emotional. You're miserable, guys. And I don't know what to do. I'm not miserable. Yes, you are. <laughs> How are you going to tell me where they're not a miserable? I can feel it. It's your energy. It radiates in every aspect of your life. I told you, if this is about work, I'm going to go talk to Mike about helping me go on my own. You've been saying this for years. You're going to do a lot of things, guy. To be honest, I don't care. I don't care what you do. But I do care that you do care and you don't do anything. It's like you're stuck and we're stuck too. So what? Am I like this horrible guy? Am I not good to you? I work my ass off. Remember all the important shit. Don't cheat. This is fucking bullshit. I deserve an award for how good I am to you. Oh, so that's the conclusion you came to? An award for not cheating? Yeah! Wow! Oh, then I must be so lucky. <laughs> I bet there are droves of women who are dying to sleep with a man whose idea of foreplay is ramming his dick between your butt cheeks while you're trying to watch Shark Tale. Yeah? Well, why do it's on the table? Maybe I'll be a little less miserable if you had sex more! Oh, I thought you weren't miserable. <laughs> I guess I didn't realize until you started talking! I'm 32 years old. I have friends who have been together for half as long as us. They have kids. I mean, we're not even engaged. Do you know how embarrassing that is for me? Why would you want to marry someone you think so fucking little of? It's not fair. All I'm trying to do is build you up and you just... I don't know what else to do. You bury everything. You act as if nothing is wrong. I'm not caving because I'm five minutes. You'll be fine, you have one. You're pathetic. And you're gonna end up just like your father. God, fuck! Congratulations! You win and I'm the fucking asshole now! You need therapy.